Our Crime Watch coverage begins in Ferry County tonight. A man being investigated for animal trafficking and illegal hunting is dead. Wildlife police say the man barricaded himself inside his home near Republic when officers came to search that house. When officers heard a single gunshot come from inside the home, they backed away and called in for more help. Nightside reporter Kyle Simchuk brings us the latest from the scene. Not what we were expecting to deal with today. Around 10 o'clock this morning, Washington State Fish and Wildlife police officers, with search warrants in hand, tried to contact a man they've been investigating for illegal hunting and animal trafficking. We had information that there were weapons inside the, the residence, and so the officers, when they approached, they tried to call the individuals in the residence out uh, using a PA system. A woman followed commands and came out, but the man refused and barricaded himself inside the home. Then, officers heard a single gunshot. At that point, the officers backed off, called for assistance. Deputies in Ferry County and members of the Spokane County Sheriff's SWAT team responded to the property about 20 miles north of Republic. The tactical team found the man dead inside. Uh, we don't believe any shots were fired at our officers or any of the other responding deputies and officers at the scene. Wildlife police say no deputies or officers fired their weapons. Officials could not comment on what they found on the man's property. The investigation is ongoing. It's just a really tragic ending to this particular incident today. And the suspect's home is about 10 minutes up this driveway. His name has not yet been released. The woman who walked out of the house this morning was let go. More information is expected to be released from the Ferry County Sheriff's Office. For now, reporting in Ferry County, I'm Kyle Simchuk, KXLY 4 Nightside.